Kelly Lupo gets us underway with a low, a low two iron down the northern corner as the, the bunnies ruck it out through number five, Hayes Mellers. That's oh, right. Uh, Adam Blair told us that before the game. So keep an eye on him, number 11 for the Warriors. Yeah, a bit of, bit of rugby oh, nice play. Two on one. Ty Munro puts the ball down, does a, does a bit of a somersault a la Steve Maven. A bit Larry at the end of that try. Beautifully <laughs> well, worked play down the left-hand side. Well, similar to our top grade where we worked down our left-hand edge and the lethal left and Tyrone Munro, similar to what we did last week, played down that left-hand edge, a little play out the back, and we gave it to the try-scoring machine. Nice hands there. It's good as Ty Munro lines this one up uh, about a metre in from touch. Comes through, but uh, touch judges don't like that one. And a shout out to you, Brett Mailing, watching all the way from Bali. Yeah, photo low for underneath, but there he goes. There, Tanner Stower Smith for the red headgear, very distinctive. He stands out with that one. Nice carry, quick play the ball, too. Down to Fuko Fuka, he chips it over the top. Reed Gavis bosses out the fullback, scores under the post with a big Steve Maven swan dive. Outstanding try from the Warriors, came from a a, a quick play the ball. Well, he, he just picked it up and, and it was a quick play the ball from Towner Smith, the red headgear, who we were told to watch before the game. Got a quick play the ball. He took off. Fuka, Fuka. Fuka look look Fuka. at the skill nice of him. Nice chip and chase. Got the bounce and steamrolled the fullback. Dane Townsend went and scored on the left-hand side got of the it. upright and it takes it to four all. It's an outstanding try. Oh, a great try and they went straight through the middle. He got a good yeah, bounce, but... Fuka Fuka lines it up and no mistakes there. The New Zealand Warriors lead six points to four over the South Sydney Rabbitohs. SG ball. Warriors six, Rabbitohs four, 15 minutes. I think the halves would like it a bit earlier as Liam LeBlanc gets to try and get into a bit of a hit and spin situation, but the Warriors are equal to the task. He gets a quick play of the ball away. It's out to Hawkins, long ball out to Drew Williams. Drew Williams, dummies, dives over and scores in the right hand corner. And that was a well worked play off the back of a really nice. Play the ball from Liam LeBlanc. Well, unlike the last try where we went down the left, this time we go down the right-hand side, chaps. Uh, we, we mucked around, around the middle of the field and then we decided to come down the right-hand edge. It was a nice pass there from Herring from dummy half. And the long ball from long Hawkins ball from, um, put him into space. Yep. And got on the outside of his man and Williams goes over for the second try for the Rabbitohs and that takes us to eight points to six with... 14 minutes to go. Sure. They really worked him over uh, around the post there. I think it was JC with the hit up. It was a bit of a slow play of the ball. As Ty Munn looks to bend this one back, it just held its line out to the left. That's uh, two unconverted tries by the Rabbitohs. South Sydney Rabbitohs, eight. New Zealand Warriors, six. 12 minutes, 50 seconds to go in the SG ball clash. Round one, historic clash here. First time South Sydney have ever played the New Zealand Warriors. Two 300-game absolute NRL legends coaching against each other. Adam Blair making his debut. Johnny Sutton's been in the coaching rank for a couple of years, and he's at the helm of the South Sydney Rabbitohs. Yeah. Live and free on Bunnies TV, and the Warriors are on the attack here, and a dangerous side, boys. Are, Bunnies will have to be on their game here in defence. He looks a little live while the, uh, the bench hooker. As they turn the big Patrick Moimoy underneath. I wonder if he's related to... Fooey, fooey, no, I don't, boy, think he, I don't think he is, Adam Blair said. I don't think he is. He's got a nice bounce. Oh, as they go in in the corner, the grip. And that was uh, number five, C.O. Carly. Jeez, the bounce of the ball has gone the Warriors' way when they have put it in out the back. That was a yeah. nicely worked um, short side raid. It uh, certainly has, Taps. Two chaps, two tries uh, off two kicks, and the bounce of the ball has gone their way on both of them tries. They worked down that short left-hand side with a nice little kick there from Pilu and got the bounce of the ball and once again they go over Yeah, in the nice corner. kick by Pilu but I like what I've seen from, from the bench player number 14 who's come off uh, they've given um, Fuko Fuko a spell and uh, Felipe Talasau very sharp out of dummy half he's got the Warriors on the front foot some of those forwards coming onto the ball and they've given the, the kicking duties to Nabarisi I think that moves in no, not a nice strike there. He just missed it over to the right-hand side. Sorry, and a shout-out uh, there from Colin Pearce. He's a first-time viewer of the SG Ball, 27-year Warrior fan. 
Nice hearing Aussie commentators being fair in comments to both sides. Well, there you go. Yeah, well, appreciate that, uh, not, not, Colin. Only, not only are we live and free, we're fair and free here on Bunnies yeah. TV. Don't worry about that. The warmest temperatures in nearly 10 years as Ty Munro gets us underway as he kicks oh, yeah. into that nor'east breeze. About 26 degrees here at uh, game level down here at Ironmark High Performance Centre, Redfern. Work out from their own line. There's a, there's a bird on the field as it just takes off. <laughs> it's, it's got a decent nose on it too. It's got a hooter as uh, Ty Munro <laughs> takes the offload, fleet-footed Tyrone. Our wingers are really, uh, really happy to do the work here. He's, he's had some tough carries, put some shots on him. Brownie, we've got someone on the chat too. Yeah, YT just donated $10. Uh, a big quick thank hands. you. Brilliant. Back to the action. Drew Williams, two on one. He's got Hayes Mellors on the outside, brings it back. Underneath for the Warriors. Who is it on the ground there, boys? Is it? Is it? Uh, um, that's Liam LeBlanc. Okay. It's Liam LeBlanc might have took a little shot in back play. The, uh, the, 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 the fresh Coogee resident. He's down at Coogee. What a, geez, that's a tough place to live, Coogee, isn't it? Like, yeah. Hey, <laughs> that we done. Hello, yeah. legend. There's Hame. I'm aware of. He's going all right. His, bro his brother's on How the field you, there. Yeah. Not too bad. Setafano's playing well, mate. Um. There's plenty of, plenty of fans here so I think we got to Paul. watch the first game of the season. Now our, our Harold Mello. Matthews had a bye. Paul Mellor there in the blue blue cap brownie. Yeah, his yeah. Nep nephew's playing, the, the, the right centre. Williams, Williams. try scorer today. Well, well we've seen that in the NRL um, last year. There was a lot of short dropouts. I think people are playing the percentage, and they're happy to sit on their line and, and, and back their own um, goal line D. That's right. And maybe South Sydney were thinking the same thing there as we've got a double change here for South Sydney Rabbitohs. Setafane Sele comes off as we go left out to Murray. Murray skips it out to Taiman. Taiman beats one. He's rounded up by the, the second and third demand. They get a shout out to Daniel Berndred, the cousin of uh, Dane Towns. He's up there at Mackay as they throw the dummy. Oh, Back he's dropped inside. It. He's butchered that one. Yeah, the line wide open. And they're not easy to take those ones, and but Pat it was a little high. But Patrick Moimoy just puts it down with the line wide open. It would have been a certain four points. He would have improved his position and come and scored under the post. Yeah, he was the biggest bloke from. in the yeah, world. But yeah. He can play 5'8", chaps, as he, well. He's an outstanding Austag player, too. Nice uh, numbers Murray, there. Murray puts two on one to Dane Towns. Ty Munro, can he come back inside? Oh. Oh. As the Warriors fans go up, Nubber... Nabarisi come across in cover and absolutely wailed him there. Was that a shoulder charge though? Cocked his arm possibly. And Nick Fitzgibbon, $3.49, all the way from New Zealand. So we appreciate every donation that comes in. As they're on again down Thank here, this left-hand side. They've skipped away. He comes off his left foot there. Patrick's... Oh, great. Oh, that's right. Uh, oh, double movement. Double movement, yeah. He just, he was, he was caught just a, a centimetre short of the line. He, he should have just died with the tackle there. First of all, the last line defence from Dane Towns was outstanding. He stopped the play, but un unfortunately, they, they were fortunate for the Warriors. They got an offload, but scrambled defence from the South Sydney Rabbitohs to get back there and force the player to double movement and get a penalty. So as should a be very proud of this young New Zealand side. They're only 16 minutes away from coming up with the first two points of the yes, season. Yeah, just a... Try and get a better field position as Hayes Mellers. Big carry. He keeps going. Nelly lost the pill. Oh, offload. Out to Munro. Munro's got someone in support, but another offload. Back to Bailey Smith. On to Brett Hawkins. To Drew Williams. Over the halfway. There's a lot of ball movement in that one, Brownie. Well, one more pass would have been great, but Hayes and Mellers was on this side doing a tough carry and started that play off. Oh, Setavane Sele as Bailey Smith kicks over the top for himself. Waits for a bounce. Nabarisi's there to clean up the scraps, but... They're going to take him over the sideline here. No. Around, oh, this might be the last tackle too, I think. Yeah, we're going straight in. This is the last tackle. The... Hawkins puts a nice kick in. Cross field looking for Hazen Miller to the basketball. Goes up, up he scores. catches it. Comes down with a try. The referee likes it. Oh. oh. No, he's waved it off. He dropped it. They went up here. Jeez, that was uh, really athletic by... Hazen Mellers, he must have just coughed it up. We're, we're, we're on the opposite side of that, by the way. So he's, uh, he's had a good game. He's got a nice kick on him, but it's, out, it's play on here. Murray puts a towering oh, bomb up. He's, he's, hit with, he's hit with a late shot. It's back to Ty Munn. Ty Munn. Gets the penalty. But they've given a penalty. It was a big shot late. I think it was the, the bloke who had the error just before, Harry Durbin. Uh, uh, he's very big thank you, thank you for to that. you, five-star. 
He's missed oh, it. God. He's missed that one. Just just pulled it slightly to the left. Hey, it's a nice ball move. We go out to Hawkins. Hawkins got a bloke off his hip. Dummies goes back on the inside himself. Hawkins beats one, beats two. Offload in the middle to Selle. Selle out the back to Fletcher. Penalty. Penalty. Oh, we're gonna have, we'll have to take the kick this time. Shoulder charge. Oh, it could be on here. There's a bit of push and shoving. Thomas Fletcher's in there. No, it's not. It's Heslin. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, they've got to settle this one down. Refs have got a tough job here. He's only a little fellow, the ref. A lot of pushing and shoving. Hold on. That's starting to settle down. We'll have to send Darren Brown down there from nah. Bunnies TV <laughs> to sort this out. He's our, he's our muscle man on the show. <laughs> With two minutes to go. Two minutes, 45 seconds. It's a penalty to South Sydney Rabbitohs here. Hey, hey. There he finally, finally got it. calls time off. John Sutton. Indicated to his watch there. No, I think that's wrong on the website, chaps. So I think they're having some issues. Yeah. Has he, he's missed it again. Oh, what, what so happened? The goal kick has, has let the South Sydney Rabbitohs down. down today. Yeah, oh, yes. yeah they, they marked up. They, they, were, they were equal to the task there as Sally Great mu- muscles his way nice to the offload. middle. Offload. Goes left to Murray. Murray long ball to, to Daniel oh. Wright. Daniel Wright. In heavy traffic and great, great defense by the Warriors as the Warriors fans go up. That's been a, a, a fantastic defensive performance by the Warriors in the second half. We've had raid after raid on their line and they just keep turning this uh, South Sydney side away. There's been plenty of effort from both sides and that. As the uh, clock winds down to 50 seconds, that might be just about it for the Rabbitohs. Yeah, the Warriors will take their time as the referee blows time off with 50 seconds to go. Ben Patrick Moy Moy and Tanner Smith, bit of footwork around the middle with a red headgear, distinctive red headgear. We got and tipped. the fans told us about him before the oh, game. He's a good player. He's had a big game. He reminds me of, remember, Paliasena, yeah. the big fella, the Rhino, as they go wide. And that's it. And there it is. Congratulations to the New Zealand Warriors as their fans go up. They've just beaten the Rabbitohs. Ten the, points to eight. And a credit to the mighty South Sydney Rabbitohs. They tried hard all the way to the death. They nearly scored in, uh, with a couple of minutes to go. Unfortunately, the goal kicking let us down today. And the Warriors go on to win ten points to eight. And they're going to be a force, chaps, later in the year. It was a great game of footy. Some great players on display. And and, and what about Daryl Lee, man of the match, mate? Who are you giving the points to? I know I've got a few thoughts here, but um, I know to, for myself, I think Tanner Stowers Smith down the middle of the field was outstanding. You see his bit of footwork at the end of that game. He just kept rolling up the sleeves nonstop. The two hookers were good from the Warriors in rotation. Yeah. Um, their back five were pretty strong defensively when they, they made a few adjustments. We opened them up early in the first half. Bunnies uh, TV, live and free. Thank you, guys. We're going to have some merchandise um, available for sale coming up in the coming weeks if you want to support the show. Thank you for joining us. My name is Grant Chapel. Chaps, Darren Brown, Brownie, and Steve Maven. We've got stickers there the as well. Thank you very much.